look who I found. She's sitting there controlling the lights. My daughter's LED lights. That's hilarious. They're ready for the party, I guess. Ever since they've been wearing these fun, fancy dresses, they've been ready to, I guess, just have fun and party it out, celebrate that Christmas is almost here. Good morning. What is up? It is officially Friday morning. Cheers to Starbucks. Um, it's been a week, a whole week. I'm so behind on editing. I'm so behind just on free time type stuff. Um, but very happy that it's almost the weekend. I have a couple of busy days ahead just because of holiday shopping and, um, you know, little events happening with um, loved ones, but it'll be a good weekend. I feel it. So just wanted to come on here and say hello. I am still working today, so I got to get back to do what I got to do. But it was so cold downstairs that I was like, I'm just going to opt for a little bit of some warm and fuzzy time while I work in my bed. Because before you know it, I'll be back in the office and I won't be able to do this anymore. So with that said, I'm going to go ahead and get back to my grind and I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will check in throughout the day as things come up. All right. On my lunch, picking up the kiddos. They got off early today because today is finals and um, so here I am. I look really dead, like I don't want to say dead, but I look really tired. I'm just not wearing any makeup today. I've actually had stuff on even mascara the last couple days and today is like the first day that I was like zero only because I'm gonna be showering here um, as soon as I get back home I wanted to wash my hair but I didn't want to do it in the morning because it's so cold so now that the kiddos are gonna be home it's gonna shower and then um, after work I'm gonna get ready and actually put on like my face because I have a little um, gift exchange going on at one of my good friends house and I figured why, I don't have any meetings today where I have to worry about being on camera, so why worry about putting on anything, mascara, etc., if I'm just gonna have to wipe my face off later to actually do my face, if that makes sense. So I figured I'll just wait, I'll wash my hair, and then later on after work, I'll just kind of rinse off and then actually do my makeup or whatever, so. Yeah, so we got going on, and the nice thing for mom is that now that the kids are going to be home early, I can get them started on their chores while I'm still home, enough to be able to supervise and get it done. Mm-hmm. Wonderful. Um, the rest of my work day should be pretty low-key, hopefully. Um, low-key as in it's work, but it's fun work. I'm going to try to finalize our work um, PowerPoint for next week's virtual um, holiday luncheon. I'm also going to um, finish off or finish up our Kahoot trying to um, update the questions I'm adding in you know to make it kind of like fun for holidays but also diversity you know the whole um, we want to try to tie in as much as we can um, into our workflows so making sure that it has that diversity and inclusion um, equity and inclusion aspect of it so we're going to add the concept into it and still make it fun at the same time um and hopefully the kids are here it's, it's always um one of those things where either you show up too early or you show up too late and they're waiting for you so hopefully they'll get here soon because like i said i want to shower and actually wash this hair out before i have to get back so all right you guys i will see you all later bye oh my gosh so it's already past five o'clock. I barely finished blow drying my hair. I had um, put the pork chops on soon as soon as I got off work. So I'm here showing you. This is what happens. I'm trying to keep my hair back though, so I don't want it to end up in the food. And pork chops are looking a little crispy, not burnt. But you know, it's funny. I wasn't gonna vlog because obviously I'm in a hurry. But I, I just wanted to come on here and really quickly 
And I do apologize because as you can hear, the Roomba is going crazy in the back. And a lot of times when people say, how do you do it all? This is exactly how. Sometimes you burn your food because you're too busy trying to blow dry your hair, because you're too busy throwing in a load of laundry, because you're too busy trying to get the dogs back in their kennels so that they don't, you know, pee while you're not sitting there watching them. And you just do what you gotta do. And sometimes you're late to parties. And I already messaged my friend. I said, bro, I just got off work. I don't know about you guys, but I don't know if you, any of you have ever tried to create a Kahoot. Kahoots take longer than you would think that they do. They've actually, um, I'm like sort of reusing, I'm like recycling what I created two years ago for our holiday party. And Kahoot has come a long way because, well, one, they charge more now and i can only imagine they took advantage of the pandemic but we're not going to get into that but they actually suggest like if you start typing in a question they have pre um pre-created questions and answers and photos if you even want which is cool but i was like i don't like because i'm trying to incorporate information about other cultures i'm having to cross check everything i think that's why it's taking so much longer because i'm having to cross check i don't the last thing i would ever want is to create something that offends a coworker and defeats the entire purpose. Um, like, oh, I do have one. I'm gonna make pork chops. I'm making pork chops, but I'm gonna make them in chile. Hmm. I might actually end up needing both, half of one and half of the other, unless I have the green little can which I love that salsa and I usually try to keep it on hand, but because I love it, I also use it just that quick. So, let's stop. Sorry, my pants is a mess. So I'm gonna use the leftover, this one. The only time I have leftovers is when I make chilaquiles because I only use half of it, which is why I like having the cans because it's like the equivalent of half of one of these. And I have one on back, on deck, back up. But yeah, that's kind of reality of my life and being a mom. I could have easily, you're probably like, you're making it too hard on yourself. You could have just, you know, bought the kids something fast food. But it's expensive, one, for family of six. And two, they already ate out. Yeah, I think I made dinner Wednesday. But yesterday we ate out at Little Caesars. And Little Caesars, for any of you who go to Little Caesars, I remember back in the day, that was like the bargain pizza. And it still is, don't get me wrong. Ooh, chili. But even with what I bought, it was still a good deal, but I mean, it was still almost 50 bucks. So, you know, oh shoot. I never turned on the fan. I should have done that a long time ago. Because I had the Roomba on, I didn't even notice. Surprise the, um, usually my stove has a sensor so that when it's smoky, it'll tell you to turn on the fan and it didn't. My daughter likes the red one, the one I use the red chili, but that requires I use homemade, a homemade chili. I, have, I would have to do the whole chili thing like I did for the enchiladas a couple weeks ago. So yeah, uh oh, my friend's calling me. Let me see what's up. All right, you guys. So I guess it worked out that I'm running a little late because my friend needs me to pick up the lumpia that she orders. So it kind of works out. Now, there wasn't much oil in here, but because you can notice it got a little crisp on some of the edges, I think the brown is just from the oil from overcooking a little bit because I was upstairs trying to go dry my hair. Again, going back to that. <laughs> but it still looks good. If anything, it's just going to be a little crispy. And I'm just going to let, I'm actually going to, you know what, I'm actually just going to go ahead and turn it off and just let it sit in its own juice in the heat and I'm going to cover it. I need another lid like this. These are the same exact like lip size or whatever you call it. The top is the same size. But when it comes to the, um, the lid, it only comes in with the actual pan. And I just need to do my homework and order another lid because I'm having to go back and forth. And I've always been like that. But the rice is pretty much cooked, so it should be okay. Let me grab a little spoon. Mm, it's a little bit more. I already turned off the burner. Uh, 
just gonna do this and I'll see you. Actually, I do have something I could cover. I usually use like a cake pan or some, or one of those like cookie pans and then I, cookie sheets and then I just cover it on top of there. Because all it needs, this one doesn't really need cooking. It just, it's fine. I'll use the same one. Let me taste this. It's not too much juice. Mmm, that's really good. I'm actually going to put a little bit of water in there though. I'm going to put a little bit of water just to break it up a little bit because I don't want it to get too thick. There we go. But I also don't want it too for water. You just gotta play with it. But that's perfect. Should be good. Try it again. Then if you put too much water, you lose the flavor. Oh yeah. That's perfect. And there's dinner. A lot quicker than I expected. It's 5.15. I'm going to go get myself together so I can get out of here hopefully within 30 minutes. See, it's called you do what you got to do. <laughs>